up guys, Liam here. Welcome back to LSJ TV. Today we are going to be discussing my current diet, my current training plan, everything along those lines, right? I've not had a dedicated video. I've kind of mentioned it here and there and if you've been watching closely, you kind of get a picture of where, where I'm at, you know, weight wise, physique wise, diet wise, training wise, everything, right? But I've not had a dedicated video and that's the thing, right? Because I get daily questions on Instagram, where we're at, what I'm doing with summer shredding, what's happening, am I competing, am I not, am I doing this, am I doing that? And I feel like I need an entire video, a dedicated video like this one, to kind of clarify a few things. So, here goes nothing. It's gonna be a good one. We're down at the gym, upper body sesh. It's gonna be a good one. Just drop it a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get into it. session training at the minute is a it's a bit of a mixture right um, I've been following five days right five days per week every single week without fail sometimes more and then just doing kind of accessory days like leg rehab and abs and all that kind of stuff abs, leg rehab on certain days right but I I've had to do certain things and not do certain things on certain days because of work, right? I've had to do chest because of myself and Cy were filming a video about chest, but I only trained chest two days before. So my plan over the past few weeks has been very hit and miss. I've still loosely followed my upper lower push pull legs plan, right? However, a few weeks ago, I decided to start incorporating a bit more arm content, a bit more arm days, and it's already paying off and I'm really, really happy with the results. So I'm going to start doing that every single week. I've been training for a good five years now, but I've never, for the entire time, actually incorporated that into the training plan, right? So, you off, lads. You too, mate. I'll catch you in a bit. I'll see you in the comments section, yeah? See you in, see you in the comments. Two, two, uh, two lads from, from Dino's gym, actually. You guys know Dino, the guy who, whose podcast I'm gonna be editing in the very near future. Um, they're from his gym. Just got talking to them. Um, nice lads. Nice to meet you lads. Anyway, back to arm days. So, I used to do push pull legs, upper lower. Obviously that is one push, one pull, one leg workout. Upper, which is the entire upper body, and lower, right? I switched out that lower body day for an arm day. That might sound ridiculous, but my leg days increased in volume a hell of a lot. So they increased to basically being a three hour leg day. An intense, hard, once a week leg day. And that would be all you actually need. If you train legs like Sai, which is essentially what I started doing, taking on all the tips and everything that he has been giving me over the past few months, start training legs like Sai, um, you only need to do them once a week. And that is a fact. You don't want to be doing them. You can't be doing them any more than once a week, purely because your central nervous system can't hack it along with all the other training, right? So, regardless of filming on certain days and not filming on certain days, training certain things on certain days, the initial plan, the loose plan that we've been following is five days. Push, pull, legs, upper, arms. Might sound bizarre, but I am making gains on this plan in a deficit. Do not knock it until you try it. Let me know. Would you like to see it in a plan? Six, seven quid for you guys to buy for the rest of the summer? Let me know. I'm on a session. Yeah. Strawberry laces. There's about half a scoop left in there. 
It's okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, yes. Okay. The smell from this one, ladies and gents. If I'm being honest, Clearway doesn't normally smell like much. It doesn't normally smell very nice. It normally tastes really nice, but the smell from the tub, you don't normally go, mmm, it kind of just smells like nothing, right? This oh, is the only one that actually really smells nice. The smell that oozes from the tub, especially a fresh one. Oh, oh God, I spilled it everywhere. The smell that comes from the tub is like no other flavour of clear way. We are having a golden hour here in the flat. It's actually like quarter past seven at night and as of late, obviously with the weather changing, times changing, everything like that, this used to happen at about five o'clock when we first moved in. Now it happens at about seven o'clock. I kind of missed it by a few minutes. Oh, there's my phone. But you get the gist. It's just a lovely, bright, open um, space. Lovely stuff. Hmm. And since it was really hot a couple of weeks ago, I've actually been putting bottled water, well, bottles of water in the fridge. Oh, why am I fishing that out? I need to get the rest of... Okay, there's maybe about an entire scoop here, just, just about, but that will do for the rest of that. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Come on, I can't get it. Oh my God, this is the most buried a scoop has ever been. Ah, my phone is going crazy. Okay, we're gonna put a second scoop in here, then we're gonna clean the entire side because, oh man. Anyway, as I was saying, I've been putting bottles of water in the fridge um, because it was like 30 degrees. I wanted to go to bed with a nice cold one. Um, I wanted to wake up and, and down a nice cold one. Um, I know that's not necessarily the best thing to do. They say that room temperature water is better. No one cares, Liam, get on with your story. I've been enjoying cold, fridge cold water, so just been prepping some in the fridge for when I fancy it. It's gonna be a good video today, guys. Drop in a like, comment down below. Subscribe if you want to. Thank you all for the support lately. LSJ at checkout, link in the description box. 10K coming soon on Instagram. So we can actually have a swipe up. And let's get on with the video. That is the state of the kitchen though, ladies and gents. UFB video is going down whilst I sip on this clear way. I'm gonna go for a walk in a minute, I think, because I'm going batch crazy in here. Oh, that's good. I've not had strawberry laces for a while. Mm. Okay. All right. Yep. On with the day. Okay, so let's talk about the rest of the deal. So you know where we're at with training. Um, a full physique update was only a video or two ago. Uh, so go ahead and watch that if you haven't already. But um, lastly, we are at the diet. Where are we at with that? Well, long story short, it, sh it is abysmal. It is horrific. It is anything you want to use to describe bad. That is my diet right now. <laughs> um, I'm losing body fat and that's great, but it's a matter of calories in versus calories out and rather than having your macros on point and having a well-balanced diet, you know? Um, and I need to sort that. I need to start sorting my food out a lot more than, than I am. But there's a lot going on right now and with this whole head, head injury um, thing, um, <laughs> things just aren't as they should be, you know? And I need to sort that and I will. Um, eating right now is also very difficult. Um, I can't really use my mouth properly. It's a bit of a mess, really. Um, some of you might have guessed that this video was actually filmed before the head thing happened. I'm now sat at home recovering from a pretty sketchy 
concussion. Um, we're all right though, don't worry. Um, body weight as well was in the low to mid 160s. Um, too low as well. Uh, it's not really where I want to be at right now, but um, again, there's not an awful lot I can do about that right now. Thank you for all of your support and I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, sorry to end the pretty positive video on a negative note I hate doing that um, but I can't do much else right now um, drop a like as always if you have enjoyed it um, it really helps the channel grow really helps um, support support me I'll see links and everything like that are in the description box as always as well thank you so much and I will see you in the next one